Hey, musicians, welcome to the Four Poster Bed, because I am absolutely bushed, because I upped my ballet from 30 minutes to 60 minutes. Plus, I went out to pick up a bunch of books that I bought, ballet books, um, from my mum's. And um, I, I've had, I literally had to come and have a lie down, and it's twice as long as my normal lie downs. So <laughs> Just my legs! Oh, my God! Anyway, I've had some fantastic news. The double bass strings have arrived in Oxfordshire from to my luthier and they are being mounted today. Is that the word? I don't know if you mount strings. I think you probably do. Um, this is my rockabilly double bass. So I've just done a couple of lessons without a double bass, obviously, um, on YouTube. And I've created a, a YouTube playlist called base I think I think that's what I've called it and I've made it public because I thought we could all follow it um I think that's a really good idea now I'm this lady who's doing the lessons she's very obviously very experienced um let me think if I what if I can find her name I don't know if I can hey everyone uh, there we go uh, this week we are going to look at a very her name is bamboozle the bass pixie she's really good I'm looking at her hands and I'm thinking she's got big, powerful, strong hands and I've got pathetic hands. Little, um, girly, old lady hands. That's what I've got. And I'm, I'm actually a bit nervous. And then my luthier said to me, well, you're, you must send us a, um, a video of you playing it. And I thought, well, that, that's not going to happen for a while. <laughs> it's, so, it's like crazy, crazy. Anyway, I'm watching her play and... She's teaching without music, and I'm just like, I need music, I need the music, I need to see the music, um, which obviously isn't happening with this teacher. So what I'm probably going to do is use her and just do it by ear um, and not really know what, what I'm playing. So I'll, I'll do some chords, I think, learn to play chords. Finally, I'm going to create chords in my brain you know because I haven't done that before um you know that you you can sort of get away with with the cello and the viola and piano you can get away without doing chords as such although obviously in my jazz I I have been doing chords but I, I've started improvising the piano so I figure well I'll just carry on doing a lot of improv but I'm also going to do the bass Suzuki I will do that um because I love the, I love to look at the music. It makes me feel safe. It makes me feel secure, and it helps me understand what the bloody hell I'm doing. Um, you know, even if I go by ear after I've looked at the notes. So, what she does in the first lesson that I I have put up on the um, on my playlist that's at Tao Tao Club. Um, she's she's splitting it up into chords. So I figure, well, if I just learn these chords, you know. The first, the fifth, the sixth, the fourth, I think, something like that. Classic um, blues chord um, pro progression. So I'll learn all those and and hopefully I won't have to learn too many and I'll be able to play something. But what I'm really looking forward to is the, the, what you do to these strings. And no wonder they had to wait. Um, I mean, they look so heavy and there's only one supplier of them. Um, I don't know how long they last. I mean, she really pulls the string and then it bashes back onto the fingerboard. And this is a really hard wearing instrument. It's designed to put up with a lot of abuse. So, um, you know, this is why I've 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 been prepared to wait a long time for it and also to spend a lot of money on it. But I'm so excited. I can't tell you it's going to be such fun such fun so I don't I'm assuming it doesn't come with a bow because that's not how you use rockabilly bass and I'm and I'm going to perhaps resist buying a bow although I'm already thinking oh I'd like I'd really like a bow <laughs> it's just like stop it stop it forget the bow um you know we're all a bit scared aren't we to to try new things and especially if you're a reasonably accomplished musician and suddenly you've got to do something where you're literally a child and I mean I'm having this with my ballet classes as well and I was doing ballet today watching 
a, a, a small child doing grade one and I couldn't keep up with her. Mind you, my living room is very cramped. Um, it was ridiculous. And I, you know, but, but these these children have been at it for a couple of years, you know, and they're, they're exquisite, utterly exquisite. Um, but I realised, you know, today that, God, I'm just so crap and I'm going to have to go and spring my floor shortly, which I'm going to do in a bit, um, just to make my technique a little bit easier. Um, anyway, so what can I say, guys? What can I say? Well, as soon as it comes, I will let you know and I will do um, a little a little introduction to it. Um, talk about maybe the strings and um, I'll let you know how I'm getting on with my poor technique. You see, my left hand, I'm not worried so much worried about that. Although this is, I think it's huge. I think it's a three quarter. I don't think they make um, huge ones for, for general use because they're too big. So as far as I know, it's a three quarter. Um, but yeah, and it's red and it's going to look so freaking gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I am over the moon, over the moon. And, and you know, I've I've been very patient with him. I'm, I felt like an angel being this patient. And last week I just thought, do you know what? I'm just going to give up because I was phoning every week and getting really upset and really concerned and all of these things. And then I just thought, do you know what? The universe is going to bring that instrument to me when I'm good, at, when when the universe is ready, you know, and it, and it's happened. As soon as I relax and stop getting stressed out about it, it has arrived and it feels fantastic, guys. Absolutely fantastic. So, well, have a great day. I can't stop smiling, honestly. Um, Telltaleclub.com, iserverland.com. There's going to be loads more music on the way.